Hi, welcome to my channel. So today's video is about how to charge your 12 volt battery or some other battery with this Excel 4016 module. In the previous video, I showed you how to drive your loads with this module. And now in this video, I'm going to show you only showing you that how to charge your batteries with this. It can balance charge your battery I, uh, as in my opinion, it's the best charger for any battery. So let's power it up. I'm still powering it up with my 19 volts adapter 19 volt power supply so let's adjust as you can see that it's a 12 volt 7.5 amp hours battery so of a 12 volt battery you can give 13.8 volts max or 13.9 volts for charging and charging current you can say that for lead acid batteries the max charging current for uh, charging them is 25 percent of their total capacity so if you if I measured it's 25% capacity it's about 1.5 to 1.75 ampere so let's continue towards setting the parameters so first set the voltage to 12.3 volts sorry 13.8 volts I have given complete guide in the previous video go and watch I will give the link in the description. 6 volts heading towards 12 13.8 volts. I am giving 13 point for a test. I will give 13.6 volts. Now it's done for setting the current. Current is now 4.7 amps. Let's drop it to 1.5 ampere. 1.5 ampere. So let's connect it to the battery. As you can see that as soon as I connected the battery, the red red light turned on. So when the battery is full, it will shift towards blue LED light and stop the voltage. So it's a balanced charger, safest and balanced charge for any battery. So let's wait and see how this module show you the blue light when the battery is full. If I connect the clamp meter, as you can see that battery is charging at 1.5 amps. So let's wait and see when the battery is fully charged. 2000 years later. As you can see that the blue light is turned on so let's check the voltage As you can see that the voltage is up around 13.41 volts it's decreasing because the deep charge cycle batteries can charge up to 2.3 to 3.2.35 uh, volts per cell and uh, after the full charge they the voltage dropped to the float voltage after full to full charge them you need at least 13.8 to 14 volts so after full charging the volt the flow it will drop to the float voltage so in this way you can balance charge your seal lead acid batteries with the help of this buck convert module so if you have any questions you can ask me in the comment section so hope you enjoyed the video please don't forget to subscribe my channel and stay tuned for the next video thanks for watching